Welcome to video 205 in series 3 and now I'm going to set up the vehicle camera. Okay, first step is to uh, import the camera package. So in assets, import package and uh, just get the cameras. Okay, so I'll just get all of that. Uh, just import and I just have to move it because I dumped it in that other folder. So I'll just move it to mine. Okay, so there we have it. Now what I need from here is a particular script and it's the protect camera from wall clip. So going to the main camera, drop this one on. Okay, next I need a uh, parent game object. So I'm going to make an empty game object and uh, just take that out. There we go. And I'm going to call this the vehicle camera. I will add a rigid body and I'm going to set it to is kinematic. I might as well turn off use gravity and I'm going to put my scripts on it. But before I do that, I'll just, I'll just put the main camera onto this vehicle camera. And uh, as for this, it's in the right position. It looks like uh, it's in the right uh, orientation as well. Uh, so that's all good because I had created it and it was uh, inside the main camera. That's why it's uh, now they're at the same position anyway. Okay, so now I need my uh, three camera scripts over there. So going back there, let me just lock that. Good. Just grab all three and drop them on. And that's basically it. So the camera is uh, set up. But uh, I would like to just uh, enable that main camera. Let me unlock that. Enable that. And this will start disabled to begin with. So when the player gets in the vehicle, then this camera is going to be activated and it will be supplied. Uh, its master script will be supplied with the car it should follow and the object on that car that it should follow. But anyway, that's it. So this was a very quick video. We've got stuff set up here, but uh, we won't get it to see we won't get to see it in action for a bit but anyway so i'll see you in the next video